Hello everyone. Today I am going to give some brief discussion on amenorrhea topic. As you know, amenorrhea is absence of menstruation. It might be primary or secondary. The primary amenorrhea is when a girl has not got her first menstruation or first menstrual periods. It is called as primary amenorrhea. And secondary amenorrhea. is absence of menstruation for a period of 6 months or more in a previously normally menstruating woman it is called as secondary amenorrhea so the primary amenorrhea has got two definitions here the first one is absence of menstruation or absence of menarche along with absence of secondary sexual characters by the girl attains an age of 14 years and the second definition is absence of menstruation but presence of secondary sexual characters by the girl attains an age of 16 years secondary sexual characters means development of axillary hair and pubic hair and even the development of breast were considered as secondary sexual characters presence of sexual characters but absence of menstruation by 16 years or present absence of sexual characters and along with absence of menarche by the age of 14 years is considered as primary amenorrhea now the causes of primary and secondary amenorrhea first i will tell you about the causes of secondary amenorrhea secondary amenorrhea can be seen both physiologically and pathologically physiologically means it can be seen normally in any woman in conditions like pregnancy lactation and menopause in pregnancy initially corpus luteum secretes progesterone and after that placenta takes the role of corpus luteum and the placenta secretes progesterone this progesterone maintains the endometrium so there will be no endometrial shedding in menopause the function of the ovaries is depleted the secretion of estrogen and progesterone is decreased so the endometrial growth and shedding will not occur in menopause after an age of 45 years and we can see secondary amenorrhea in pathological conditions like asherman syndrome and shehan syndrome asherman syndrome is formation of adhesions in the uterine cavity or uterine canal and shehan syndrome is postpartum pituitary necrosis i will explain this in my upcoming lectures and the causes of primary amenorrhea or turner syndrome mayer rakitsky kuster hauser syndrome also called as mullerian agenesis and testicular feminizing syndrome i will discuss these in my upcoming lectures so thank you very much